Ah, oh, shit. You know what time it is. Gay dance hey, party! Come have a drink with me. Sure thing there, sexy. You're looking happy. You had it right. Yesterday can't change. Tomorrow, we might all be dead. Could be. Today is what matters. I'm not wasting it. I wouldn't have thought a club would be to your taste. What? You don't have to what are you talking about? To appreciate graceful dancing. There's an energy here. There's light. There's titties. Some of the eye candy in the crowd isn't too shabby either. <laughs> I gotta do it. Man shizzle as I can do too. I'm hurt. Why aren't you looking over here? Oh my god. Who said I'm not? Oh uh, shit. I hear a few ladies have shown interest, but you haven't bitten yet? <laughs> Wait for the right man. <laughs> no, I'm not picking that. Uh, no time for love. Yes. I don't have the luxury of putting one person ahead of the entire galaxy. Yeah. I admire you, Shepard, but God, I don't envy you. Here. Yeah. To a new day. Here's to fresh beginnings. And a better tomorrow. Thank you. For everything. Alright, creepy. Ah, excuse me. I'm gonna go bang a fat chick so I can reinforce my heterosexuality. Well, that was awkward. Dead ass! No, really! Dead ass! I'm not gay! Check it out! Check it out! Oh my god, it's a man! Holy fuck. Shit, I'm gay. What's all this? What's all this? Commander Shepard. Guess I know what happened to my backup. Excuse me? Come on. I'm in C-Sec in civilian gear with a weapon. I know what I'm made. Just let me explain. I don't give a shit. Captain Aaron Summers, Alliance Marines, retired. Bold. Captain Summers? There's a prisoner here. C-Sec officer who helped Cerberus. Uh-huh. C-Sec caught him when you stopped the coup. Now he's offering them intel on Cerberus to get a better deal. All right. Why are you telling me this? Because he doesn't deserve a better deal. He killed people during the coup. Good people. Did he? And he's former Alliance, like us. The way I figure it, he's our problem to fix. Hmm. <laughs> Let me do it legally. I'm a specter. I can murder the fuck out of him and get away with it. Officer, I'm Commander Shepard. You have a prisoner here? A Cerberus informant? I'm invoking specter authority to take charge of him. <laughs> do what you have to do. Aw, oh, yeah. Thank you, Commander. Murder. See? That wasn't so hard. Just say, go for it. Kill the bitch. I don't give a shit. You have my permission to murder whoever you like. Except for me. Alright, back to the ship, which no doubt will lead to another half hour of talking as I go through and talk to the crew again. Shepard, I got Anderson what is it? I was just getting him up to speed. Odina? That SOB was always power hungry. But this? Yeah, he wasn't your fault. Charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the him. What the hell for? I don't, I don't know. know. Not yet. Could have been a lot worse. In the end, we only lost Count Roy Seal. And Kylang. my bitch. Kylang! Your assassin. I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. You know Kylang? Can you get me his autograph? I take it you two have met. Kaylee Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. I shot Three him in both legs once. Thought that might be the end of him. But he should have begun on Omega even stronger. Steroids. Elusive man patch him up? That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson, it's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. He'll die like all the rest. I don't care who he is. Next time we meet, he dies. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. I received word from the Asari counselor. They're requesting an update on the Crucible. Oh, yeah? Lang has them scared. Enough to send help? Mm. Mm. Yes. The Asari are throwing in their support, and the Solarians are completely on board now. Hooray! How's your progress on the Crucible? Good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly 50% of the known work. So mm. quickly? Mm. Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. It's not Prothean specific. All right. Hmm. Huh. Are we any close to understanding how to use it? Not That's really. still open for debate. 
Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. Or synthesize some things, possibly. How will it dispense the energy? And in what form? Three you colors. Mean, how do you stop it from wiping us all out? Exactly. We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus oh, this energy. Oh, don't bring up the catalyst, goddammit. How God to its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. You'll find the answer, Shepard. Oh, I bet I I'll will. I'll send you an update on the schematics. I won't like them, but I will. And in the meantime, we'll keep building. Alrighty. And we'll keep fighting. Make sure like the real ninja turtles. Nobody can stand in our way. Or my way. Cerberus, Reapers, they'll all pay for this war. One way or another. That's right. We're still in this. The gods of war haven't given up on us yet. Kratos? Good luck, both of you. And as an out. Commander, the Tyrian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships. And the Quarians are willing to talk. Oh, goody. Understood, sir. I'll look into it. Be careful. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. Alrighty. Shepard, I know this may not be the time, but I have something. Crabs? A contact within Asari High Command was insistent I pass on a distress signal to you. Okay. Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. None of them returned. Aww. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. What's your take on this? That they wouldn't ask for help if it wasn't important. I'll have to find more information. Are you all right? <laughs> Are you okay, Liara? <laughs> Not after what we went through on the Citadel. I know, right? Maybe we should talk about it later. Yeah, I think we should. Yeah. In my cabin, bitch. Commander, of course. Have you something interesting. Have you got a minute? Sure. Commander, I found something you need to see. Is it your vagina? What have you got? A group of Cerberus scientists cut ties and fled. Perhaps they finally realized they were on the wrong side. Perhaps. We don't know what they were researching, but they were among the elusive man's top scientists. They could help build the crucible. Oh, uh, yeah. If we can trust them. Unless they're indoctrinated, and this is a ruse to get Cerberus close to them. <laughs> What's I'm that face? I'm not we trust them fully, but it could be worth investigating. Oh, it could be. Has the Alliance tried to make contact with the scientists? They've been unable to find them, but they're searching. As is Cerberus. I've been monitoring Cerberus communications. Indeed. I've charted signal frequency from various Cerberus cells by location and cross-referenced known ship movements. Have you? You found them? I believe so. Yes. Nice work. Put it on the map and I'll give it a look. Maybe. It's on the map now, Commander. Thanks. Took you long enough. Commander? Commander? Alright, let me check my email. Game night? Oh yeah. She wants to see how I kill time between missions. Give me a call if you'd like to grab drinks in your cabin. Uh oh! Can we play hide the salami? Because that's my favorite. Oh shit. It's raining, bitches. Diana Allers wants to talk to me in my cabin. God. James Vega wants to chat. Fucking ass. Kyling's dossier. Ah, uh, I don't care. He's a douche. Damn, I could really use something to shoot right now. Bet you could. Commander, nice job on the Citadel. You doing okay? Yep. It had to be done. But how could Ash turn on you? She's a bitch. She was one of us. She saw what happened on Vermeer, on Ilos. And on Horizon, where we were working for Cerberus. Can you really blame her for doubting us? Yes. Hey, you didn't have a choice about Cerberus. You were dead. No I was kid. the one who ditched the Alliance over leather seats. That's a good Your reason. regret for the death of a former friend is understandable. But neither of you are... Oh, well, I'm pretty sure I am. You wish to defend humanity from Reaper attacks. Cerberus offered a viable option. The Alliance did not. Thanks, Edie. That doesn't really help right now. It helps me, because I got to see your tits again. I don't know what is it now. Hello, Shepard. What's on your mind, Edie? The destruction of the Reaper on Tachunka. Yeah? It is rare for a technologically superior force to be destroyed by an inferior one. Hey! Yeah, so now all we need is a gun that fires Thresher Moss. That would be nice. That was a joke. I'm sorry, Shepard. I was contemplating. Contemplating you said what? That asking you abstract social questions may lead to unreliable answers. 
so I stayed silent. Good for you. I didn't realize this would be an ongoing issue. Let's air it out. Yeah, well, I make my angry face. I was face. considering this. For all their supposed intelligence, the Reapers are more easily destroyed than they think. This has caused me to reassess the probable period of time before I am non-functional. As in you can't You're do it? You're worried about dying? In a sense. My processing power is consumed with calculations to help us combat the Reapers. But I can run those scenarios with the rest of the crew. May I ask you another question that troubled Jeff? Here we go again. What is anal what sex? What is the purpose of synthetic life? The job it was designed for. Killing each other. Synthetics are created with a goal in mind. Just ask their creators what it was. But my creation was planned by Cerberus. I no longer serve their purposes. Cerberus was originally created to give humanity a fighting chance. Right now, that might be a goal you can get behind. It would take significant resources and processing power. Do you think I would find it worthwhile? I don't know. Well, you could do it as a favor to me. I'd make a pretty crappy husk. I'd say you used to make a pretty crappy human. How would this differ from our present course? It wouldn't be servitude. Well, it would be, but I'm gonna lie. The difference is you decide it's worth it. No one tells you it is. I see. I will examine this issue. Yeah, you do that, Chugs. Shepard, I have examined the issue. That was quick. The Reapers threaten the crew of this ship and other organics who are helping me develop perspectives on existence. Uh-huh. Were I to approach Reapers to request similar perspectives, it is likely I would be destroyed. Yeah, probably. I would rather risk non-functionality with the crew of the Normandy than risk it alone. Oh, that's so sweet. Glad to hear it, Edie. Good to have you on board. Well, she's been on board for quite a while. Shepard, I'm keeping track of the investigation into Udina's actions on the Citadel. And? It appears he was motivated to seize power in order to launch a counterattack on Earth. Most experts and advisors uh, would agree that yeah. such a move at this point would be doomed to failure. Right. This poor plan may have been exactly what the Reapers wanted. It is possible he was indoctrinated. <gasps> he better be. At least that way he'd have an excuse. Well, he's dead now, so it doesn't matter. Commander, Dr. Michelle sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the med bay. Oh, Jesus Christ, everybody wants something. Oh, hey, Garris, admiring my wall of death. You're lucky you weren't on there. Shepard, hell of a day. Udina loses his mind. The Citadel almost falls. And now Ashley's with Caden. In hell. I hope they're both in a better place than this. Don't care. So do I. I already banged her. I know you two were close at one point. Yeah, I put it in. I can't imagine doing what you had to do. I liked Williams. She wouldn't listen. Whatever kind of friend she might have been, she brought this on herself. That's right. I guess we all make our choices, and sometimes we die by them. So let yeah. that be a lesson to you. Don't question me, bitch. That was an interesting camera shot. Anything else to say? This is one day I wish we could have back. Yeah. What the hell are you doing in here? Oh, this would have been Ashley's room. I can't stop thinking about Commander Williams. Really? When we first Hot. met, she frightened me. She was so intense when rushing into battle. I never understood what Ashley wanted to prove. But I admired her I bravery. I admired her ass. I know she meant a lot to you, Shepard. I'm sorry it ended this way. She brought it on herself. By the way, you and me should bang. We'll bang, okay? Ashley risked the Citadel by siding with Udina. It was her own mistake. Yeah. I just wish we hadn't lost someone who used to be part of this crew. Cerberus has much to pay for. Yeah, well. What I want now is information on this Cerberus assassin. I don't care. He's I a douche. I don't think it's a coincidence Kai Lang was an N7-ranked Alliance soldier too, Shepard. Maybe the elusive man misses you. That's his own fault. He should have returned my calls. Then we'd still be together. The elusive man wouldn't have to fight me if he'd keep away from Reaper tech. Cerberus as an ally would have made things easier. As it is, we'll see Kai Lang again. Unfortunately, you are correct. I'd count on it. I'll talk to you later, Shepard. Well, bang, okay? Perhaps we can talk later. Perhaps in my cabin. What is it, Doctor? Have a moment. Commander, there's something on the Citadel you might want to look into. What's that? What's going on, Doctor? A group of refugees arrived at the Citadel recently, flush with military-grade medical supplies and equipment. So? I cataloged our inventory. We have an excess of medical supplies for treating contagion, exposure, and malnutrition. What about herpes? 
There Make are sure we got that. soldiers, and we have supplies to help suffering refugees. Exactly. Perhaps you could broker a trade with them. Why me? Isn't this something you could do yourself? No kidding. A lot of war profiteering is going on, and most refugees are wary of Alliance military. What do you think they I am? trust me. But everyone knows Commander Shepard, <sighs> hero of the Citadel. Mm -hmm. They listen to you. How if I have time? We'll see. Please think about it. The trade would help everyone. A man named Tactus keeps them organized near the Citadel docks. Good to know. The equipment they have might even allow me to enhance the effects of our medigel. Ooh. Actually, that's worth it then. I don't remember what it does, but I'm pretty sure it's good. Makes the medigel work better or some shit. Breaking now, the Citadel in flames. A brazen attack by Cerberus, repelled by CSEC. Oh my god. Alliance Marines explain the Council Fleet's delayed response. We speak with the brave men and women who fought the good fight in the battle space. Battle tits. Yes, I've been watching the gamer poop videos. What are you going to do about it, Sumi? Commander, I've got some questions about the coup, but I'm online with my producer right now. Alright. Can we set up an interview in your cabin? Oh, I'm sure we can. Yes, slut. You're just begging for it. Oh, jeez. In my cycle, we had to walk 24 miles in the snow to get ice cream. Traitors are the worst form of enemy. I'll say. In our cycle, we would remove their limbs. So we saw that coming. And offer them a choice. Eat their own flesh or starve. Nice. Your politician deserved far worse than a bullet. So did the other human. Do not mourn her loss. Yeah, well, she did have there a nice ass. One enemy in this war. Reapers. No others will be tolerated. All right. I would like to visit the citadel again. Really? When it is not infested with traitors. <laughs> Good luck finding a time when that's not happening. The Kai Lang human bears watching, Commander. I sense that the blood in his veins is very cold. Ooh. Thank you, Counselor Troy, with your observance. Captain, I am sensing hostility. Pew, 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 pew. We're under attack. Thank you for that astute observation, Counselor. Hey, Steve. Never thought I'd be doing a combat drop onto the Citadel. Yeah, I know, right? I can't believe it, sure is. Shut up. Hey, Commander. I knew Dino was a dirty bastard. An old dirty bastard. I never would have guessed he was that rotten. This whole war is loco. I mean, Here can't they again. all see how we need to work together? I know. When Kate people Steema. are scared, to trust. Sure, but... Ah, oh, what's the point? Yeah, talking Look, to you, so you, what know, is the point? I've got a new shoot first, ask questions later policy when it comes to politicians. <laughs> Do you hear that hum? Is that just me? It's your brain tumor. Uh, we've talked about this. Whatever you do, do not go to the doctor and get it treated, please. Up to the cabin where the magic happens. Ooh, trainer, you're first. Trainer, if you're not doing anything, I've got a few hours free. Would you like to come up? Oh yeah. What's up, bitch? Your cabin is gorgeous. I've seen apartments smaller than this. Wanna see the bedroom? Well, Commander, ready to play? Oh, I sure am. Play. I picked up a chessboard on the Citadel. Oh. Interface, not nearly as nice as real pieces, but this takes up less space. Damn it. And I recall you delivered something that closely resembled a challenge. So, interested? That's it? The most exciting thing you can think of is playing chess. Well, if you're not up for the challenge... Bitch, I will choke you. Ha! Fuck this game! <laughs> My a cheater. Commander. It's almost as though you wanted to spare your pawns the indignity of living under my regime. Oh, you're gonna get it. In real it. life, that tactic would have worked. That's right. Well, in real life, one doesn't move on an 8x8 square grid. <laughs> you know what I mean. The pawns are infantry. A good infantry line, like the Krogan, can take a charge like that. That reminds me of a joke. What's the difference between Commander Shepard and a Krogan? Watch it, bitch. One is an unstoppable juggernaut of head -butting I see where this is going. What about playing in bed? <laughs> and the other is interested in playing another game. Oh, shit, son. Uh, 
such as? Uh, oh. Hey, I'm sorry. You seemed interested. You better oh, be. No, uh, I apologize. I try to be friendly, but you're not really my type. What? Remember how I liked Edie's voice? I like it too. What's your point? I. Oh, jeez. I didn't realize. She's not at all. playing for the I other team. Tell my friends that I broke Commander Shepard's heart and crushed him at chess. You'll never get the chance. Oh, really? I'm gonna murder you. Unless you'd like to try to reclaim your honor. Hell yes. Hell yes. Let's play some more chess. Well, this was a bust. No sex. She's a lesbo. Damn it! All she wants to do is bump donuts. All right, fine. Who's next? Trainer, can you send Diana up? She wanted an interview. And she likes dick. Right away, Commander. As far as I know. Ready for a chat, Commander? What's up, tits? I'm ready. Commander, it's no secret that Council Space has suffered some serious losses to the Reapers lately. Yeah, that's true. Now Cerberus has struck directly at the seat of our government. If something as small as a human terrorist organization can hit the Citadel, is anywhere safe? Infiltrators are everywhere. Haven't you played multiplayer? They're all over the place. Cerberus Getting all the points. Was their sleeper agents. If those agents had been exposed, a lot of lives might have been saved. We need constant vigilance. Your cameraman is drunk. This alone. We've lost a major portion of our government. The most obvious human figure being the counselor. Yep. The Alliance Parliament is destroyed, and the Prime Minister's dead. The line of succession is getting pretty short. Yeah, pretty soon How you'll be the president. How long do you expect any new alliance administration to last? You can't lose faith, tits. Leaders will rise. You can't lose hope. Our enemies won't rest until they've taken the last human being. Until then, we're not being... That's right. Right now, it's everyone's duty to step up. And it's my duty to please that booty. All right. Now a question from Thessia. Oh, Commander, during your tribunal, some said you had Cerberus ties. Of course I do. I'm evil. Thanks for your time, Commander. This is Diana Allers for Battle Space. Good night and stay strong. All right, time to do Be it. Careful, Commander. You keep feeding me like this, and I'll follow you home. I'm okay with that, bitch. Looks like you already have. What happens now? Ah, uh, shit. You gave me a good interview, Commander. That's all I need. What? But tonight, you fucking tease, goddammit! Man, she's just going to be jacking off again. All right, James. James I can't strike out three times. Privately. I'll have to put one in his ass right. pipe. He'll take one for the team. <laughs> hey, man, how's it going? Good, James. You? Good, good. So, is it hot in here, or is it just wow. me? So this is what I can look forward to when I get my own commission. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> like anyone would put you in charge of anything. You couldn't run yeah, a McDonald's. One day, when I'm old, then I can't fight worth shit anymore. <laughs> You're already <laughs> young and you can't fight community. worth shit. Sorry, Shepard. Fuck you. I guess maybe I got some things on my mind. <laughs> That's a first. I, I wanted to get your opinion on something. Uh, briefs. Definitely briefs. Jeez. What did you do when they asked you to join the N7 program? I told them to shove I mean, it. Was it a no-brainer for you, or did you think about it before? It, it was a no-brainer. I'm a soldier, Vega, and I wanted to be the best damn soldier I could be. It doesn't get better than N7. So I hear. You get the best training, best equipment, best assignments. And they expect the best in return. Yes, they do. Why are you asking? Well... Even all the shit that's going on, somebody somewhere managed to track me down and forward an N7 commendation. Ah, it's dated suckers. the same day the Reapers attacked Earth. Is it? You don't sound too thrilled. Well, aside from the fact that there won't be an N7 program if we don't win this war, I just... Being Jeez. a soldier is the only thing I've ever been really good at. You're not even and good not at that. Try. Hell, I'd have kicked my ass out years ago. Hell, last time I had they let command, me, I'd kick your ass I out. I lost almost everyone. And they promoted me for it. Well, I guess I'm I lost everyone in the last the game. I lost. I don't know if I want that responsibility. What? Ha oh wait, I don't care. Soldiers are expendable, as are you. As a leader, you've got a job to do. Keeping everyone alive, isn't it? Hell yeah, it's not. If you're afraid to send your troops into a do-or-die situation, you'll never succeed. Yeah. Did you know that before you joined the N7? You sure, ask a lot yeah. of questions. That's why I was asked. And it's why they asked you. 
There's not a single N7 that hasn't sacrificed, either themselves or their soldiers at some point. So you think I should accept? <laughs> I don't give a shit. Only you can make that decision, James. But I think you already know the answer. Suicide is the answer. I'm glad you think so. You know it. If you don't mind, maybe don't mention this to anyone else. Yeah, okay. Of course not. Hey, Just Diana. Come well, back up here. I got another I got story for you. Hang things here. It's a little too soft for me. The bed's a lot harder than it looks. But and you'll I'll never take know. Word for it. Liar. Thanks again. You know you want to sure. roll around on that bed. Anytime. You big slut. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Admiral Anderson's available in the calm room. Oh, what the fuck does he want? I'm sure it's nothing interesting. Let's check out my war assets and stuff. Uh, effective military strength, 6,751. I think I'm covered. I'm sure a shit ton of that is from playing multiplayer. Shepard. Why are you always itching your shoulder? I you to check in again. You okay? Been putting my old academy training to use. Organizing the resistance. Swiveling my head around. You know you've got quite a fan club back here. <laughs> of course. Any news we hear about the Normandy gives hope to the guys in the trenches. It'll take more than hope, buddy. I'm glad it's having an effect, but so far hope hasn't been the thing winning this war. It's been blood, sweat, and more blood. Oh, you thought he was going to say tears. But a lot of these resistance were wrong. were just farmers and teachers a few weeks ago. I don't give a fuck. When they heard that you managed to get the Torians and Krogan to cooperate, that was a shot in the arm, Shepard. Of the one thing we're in short supply around here. Brains. Faith. Oh. That any of us will live to see another day. How bad is it? It could be worse, but not much. Can you still coordinate any kind of counterattack? We're hitting the Reapers every chance we get. Mostly guerrilla style hit and runs. Lights out. It's not enough. Guerrilla radio. It's time we started focusing our efforts. Where? London. Something I see London, I see France, I see Shepard's underpants. In huge numbers. Good. Fish in a barrel. More Reapers in one place just makes them easier to kill. Leave it to you to make a full-scale Reaper invasion sound like a good thing. Yeah, well, I'm not the one that has to deal with it, so it. hey. Forever. You and me both. Oh, and Shepard. I meant what I said earlier about Kai Lang. The He's Reapers not boyfriend material. Threat him, but take it from me. Lang is a vicious bastard. Don't underestimate him. I won't. Then I'll let you get back to it. We need whatever good news you can send our way. That is enough. Good news. I'm getting closer to tapping that reporter's ass. <sighs> well, that ought to hold you fuckers off for another, I don't know, hour or so before people start bitching that I haven't put up any new videos. So I hope you've enjoyed more Mass Effect 3 Asshole Edition. I'll attempt not to take another three or four weeks or however however long it was between videos before I make out make new ones. So I hope you enjoyed this stuff. See you for the next one. Peace out, bitches.